Dia de los Muertos is worth looking at in art class because it's such a creative, colorful, vibrant celebration, and a lot of artists are involved in carrying it out. Most known is the skull symbol or the calaveras. People from the Central Americas have often been using skulls to represent life and death in art since before the Europeans ever came to Mexico. And in modern day celebrations, they make something called the sugar skull, which is a treat made directly from sugar, but decorated to look really fantastic and joyous. There's always tons of detail covering the sugar skull. There's always a lot of variety in how the sugar skulls are designed. And when you look more closely, you can start to check out the kinds of detail, the kinds of line and shape that people use to design treats and other art. People also use the sugar skull design for face. So take a look and see what you like for your sugar skull. There's lots of heart shapes, leaf shapes, dots, stars, and more. You can use thick line, thin line, repeated line. You're going to use some level of symmetry, but it doesn't have to have symmetry. And then in addition, you'll be using dark paper. So think about how you'll use marker to transform your paper tile. So in order to form your sugar skull today, you have to start with a very smooth ball you can slowly morph it into an egg shape and then you can use a finger or a pencil to make deep eyes either that go all the way through to your dark paper tile or that you'll later maybe use some dark marker on. Keep your design very smooth because you'll be able to more easily draw on lots of design and nose and teeth. That's it. Have fun.